go. As you can see, we did manage to do these without a funnel because if you just really carefully pour from one to the other, then it's fine. And that first amount of paint that I put in the first bottle is more than enough for all of these bottles. So I'm just doing this so it gets a nice um, edge around the top of the bottle. But it probably will smudge and you can just clean it up a bit with um, mineral taps and an old rag. See, look at the top of that bottle. That's nice. So Anthony did some. They were a bit rubbish, like this one. Mm. That's about it, really. They look good. So you have to do them just in white. I'm sure you'll find some old white oil paint or enamel paint kicking around someone's garden shed. But don't go and buy a whole load of new one. And if you do want to play around and buy some paint, then only buy a really small pot because it lasts ages. And that's about it. I think we're going to do all of these bottles with this one. You might have to just keep twisting them as they dry over the next few days and keep them outside because it really smells. And Anthony got some on his new trousers. Very naughty. <laughs> <laughs> That's it, Bob. I've run out of things to 